told you a little while ago, our economy will be US dollars 55.2 billion by the end of the coming financial year. This would mean that our economy will have grown by 37 times it has increased 37 times in size compared to Uganda's economy of 1986. Therefore, we have done a good job on the three tasks. This task should be clear to all of you who get involved. In, in running public affairs. Otherwise, you will make a lot of mistakes. The three tasks are what we call minimum economic recovery. That is what we set out to do in, in 1987. Minimum economic recovery, number one. Two, expansion of the sectors that had recovered, those sectors which had recovered, to expand them. And three, diversification from the original narrow, nar narrow spectrum of the colonial times of the three C's and three T's. You remember I have told you many times about that economy of the colonial times of the three C's and the three T's. The three C's being cotton, coffee, and copper, and the T's being tobacco, tourism, and, uh, and tea. So therefore, number one, we restored that small economy which had been destroyed. That is what we call the minimum recovery. Secondly, we expanded that small, uh, small economy. That's why, for instance, you hear that coffee, which was two million bags, is now nine million bags. A tea, which was 23 million kilograms in 1986, is now 60 million kilograms. So, number one, recovery. Number two, expansion. Number three, diversification from the original narrow economy of the three C's and three T's to many more commercialized products, such as what? Fish, fish was dying of old age in Lake Victoria here. But now we have something like, uh, I, at one time we had gone to 22 factories, but uh, now I think we have like 12 factories of, of fish. Maize. Maize was just f for roasting on the roadside. People didn't know that, that maize was money. But now maize, in fact, they used to make a distinction between what they called cash crop and food crop. And food crop was supposed not to be cash crop. So maize was cash crop, uh, was food crop not cash crop, it is now both. Bananas, milk, milk, that's how my tribe had been left out of the money economy by the colonial people. M milk was just for drinking and making the Banyamkwere women very fat. 
but it was not a source of money. For money, for, for, for milk of, of selling in the towns, it was coming either from abroad or from Kenya, KCC. Beef, cocoa, beans, gold, etc., all these have now been added. So therefore, clearly, minimum recovery, expansion, diversification should be clear to all of you who, who talk so much about some of these things. Those are the three tasks. But we also added a fourth task, the knowledge economy. President Museveni has promoted 1,638 gazetted police officers, including nine senior commissioners of police and 17 commissioners. This is the second promotion of gazetted police officers from the rank of assistant to superintendent of police and above. Internal Affairs Minister Major General Kahin Dotafile said on Friday that President Museven promoted nine officers from the rank of Commissioner of Police to Senior Commissioner of Police. Seventeen officers were promoted from Assistant Commissioner of Police to Commissioner of Police. Thirty-seven officers were promoted from Senior Superintendent of Police to Assistant Commissioner of Police. Officers from 199 officers from the rank of Superintendent to Senior Superintendent of Police, 976 officers from Assistant Superintendent of Police to Superintendent of Police, and 400 from Inspector of Police to Assistant Superintendent of Police. In the exercise of powers vested in the President under Section 9, one of the Police Act Cap 003 and on the advice of the Uganda Police Authority, His Excellency the President has appointed and promoted 1,638 gazetted police officers to the ranks of Senior Commissioner of Police, Commissioner of Police, Assistant Commissioner of Police, Senior Superintendent of Police, Superintendent of Police and Assistant Superintendent of Police, General Otafile said. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.